This is a SJ7 Star, a flagship action camera from SJ Cam, marked as true 4K camera, which means no interpolation tricks. This is rising bar for expected video quality sky high. SJ Cam ships SJ7 in rich package, but still, I would like to see remote controller bundled in standard package. That would be sweet. Let's focus on build quality. SJ Cam decided to go with premium build, using metal frame for SJ7. Camera feels sturdy and well built. Button layout is logical and button presses have excellent feedback. Micro SD slot accepts 64GB cards. Micro USB Type-B port is used for charging and synchronization. SJ7 supports external microphone, which can be connected on the same port with adapter. On the front we see wide lens with Sony IMX117 12MP sensor. Material used is quality plastic. We also can see two buttons and LED light. Battery compartment door is upgraded. Now it feels solid and sturdy. Inside we can find 1000 mAh battery, which depending on recording mode provides different battery life, which on average is around 1 hour and 30 minutes. Major difference between SJ6 and SJ7 are SJ7's true 4K capabilities with better image sensor and already mentioned premium build quality. Also, SJ7 ditched front screen, which can be useful in many situations. Backside is occupied with 2-inch touch screen. Viewing angles aren't so great, but touch screen works ok, it could be more snappy and fluent. UI is logical and intuitive. You can find everything fast and jumping from mode to mode is easy from quick selection panel. SJ Cam SJ7 Star can operate in various modes, dash cam or camera on your drone. It is up to you to find best purpose for it. So what about actual video quality? Pixel peepers will probably find some flaw, but I really like what I see. 1080p can be recorded in 30, 60 and 120 FPS. In 30 and 60 FPS modes, gyro stabilization can be enabled. Keep in mind that 1080p is only resolution where gyro stabilization is available. 1080p is really sharp, with realistic colors. White balance works excellent in every test situation. In simple words, I like what I see. Footage looks clean without artifacts in all resolutions, except 120 FPS and higher frame rate resolutions, where high line skipping is clearly visible. 4K in 30 FPS is astonishing, a lot of details with even super view mode in which SJ7 can record at 25 FPS. I will urge you to download samples from link in description box, as footage above 1080p is downscaled to fit in this video. Interesting resolutions are 1080p in 120fps and 720p in 240fps, which offers great slow motion effect. Footage is a bit soft with a lot of line skipping, but slow motion effect is great. This is SJ Cam SJ7 Star internal microphone audio test. Before, the LG Cam didn't have a, a strong point in audio quality with their internal microphones. Things get better with uh, LG 6, but with LG 7, internal microphone got pretty decent. But things can get even better. With LG Cam official external microphone, audio quality really goes sky high. Audio files will probably find a, a problem with it, but for every usual normal user, the audio quality will be more than satisfying. If you are vlogging or recording some uh, um, audio with you performing or something like that, you will be satisfied. Images produced are 16 megapixels, which is interpolated from 12 megapixels sensor. Pictures are fine and usable, but nothing to brag about it. After a few weeks with SJ7 Star, I have that taste of satisfaction in my mouth. Video quality is really something, camera is adaptive for every situation and in package you find a lot of accessories. And if you have some add-on from other action cameras like GoPro, you will be able to use them, as they use same mounting method. What I would like to see is stabilization in lower resolutions below 4K. Someone say downsides, having stabilization in higher resolutions would be great, but still it is not a big deal. But this is a personal preference. Even GoPro 5 can't do 4K stabilization and it costs a lot more. 
Other things which I noticed is that the camera can get really hot on touch on longer recording seasons, but this didn't interfere with AJ7 Star performance. So do I recommend AJ7 Star? Definitely yes. I really like video quality, which is comparable to well-known and much more expensive brands. For a fragment of price you get excellent video footage and overall rich package of features for every possible situation. Untouched video samples can be downloaded from link down below. And if you're interested in AJ7 Star, you can find it on official AJ Cam store on link down below. Help me to produce more great content. Subscribe, like and share. And until next video, see ya.